Today I want to introduce you to new features inside MQL log. It is update notification. Okay, what is update notification? Sometimes you need to notify your users about new updates of your project or any important news um, you have. So you can use the update notification to notify project updates or your own updates so it is kind of news okay let's give it a try downloads as you see in my demo project I have eight revisions and just run one of them let me open let me run the revision tree for example as you see it is the moving average just ticking every second to demonstrate that it is working okay just click to the update notifications and click to the update okay revisions are versions version numbers inside projects so you may have different uh, revision numbers inside the same project so they are because sometimes they are caused from uh, replacing source code or sometimes from updates in ML versions okay as you see we do have different revisions and every revision have different source code and DLL file different date expiration date ML version project ID all, all is different so it can be that you have uh, five um, clients here sitting seven here eight here and so on so you what then but you have a new revision so you have to update them uh, notify them about new update actually so let's make an example now update notification it notify let's say we want to just notify all the people they have revision 3 so here revision is 3 you have to define an update URL let's now make it like google.com dear users please update please update your expert advisor using the update URL thank you for your trust so that's our message we have to make it enable save and don't forget to save the changes now let's look what happens here let me close it and let me open new and let me apply the revision one I applied revision one you see there is nothing no notification let me close it let me open revision 8 you see it's running and it is also not notified let me run revision 3 and you see dear user please update your expert advisor using update URL what is the update URL the update URL is the URL you have defined in the backend in this case it is google.com so your users may close it so if they close it uh, everything works like usual and next time they apply again they see this again so they can click to update now and as you see Google will be opened because we have defined the Google URL so it's pretty nice feature to use so let me let's experiment more let's say at update at update to all revisions they are older than three update them with fx1.net dear user your EA your EA is too old please update it immediately enabled save save so what will happen Our revision 3 will get the soft notification revision 1 will get the other one please update it immediately as you see if they click to the update now they get to the FX one so you can define different um, messages for different revisions you can even target let's say 8 
copy enjoy your revision page so enable it save save and if I apply revision 8 now you see enjoy your revision 8 so so you can use it for all kind of notifications and um, as soon you don't want it just remove and don't forget to save the changes and next time they update you see 8 is not notified anymore so you can edit for example let's make it disabled make change and let's apply the revision 3 again and you see it is it is just disabled if you enable it again and save changes and it will notify revision 3 again works perfect thank you very much for watching